We don't create bags, we create stories. A handbag can be used by anybody. Doesn't matter the size, the age. It's very accessible. I'm Carolina. I'm Andres. And we are the co-founders of Minan Mon. He's an architect, I'm an artist. We love stories, we love colors, we love art. So we wanted to translate that into an object that people can carry. We opened our first pop-up in 2016. When we saw our first bag, this woman approached me and she said, I love this bag. I love this bag. She said, I want to buy it. <laughs> I was like, really? <laughs> on the spot. You never buy anything on the spot. A few minutes later, I was calling Carolina and said, Yes, we sold one. I'm like, I cannot believe it. <laughs> it was a rough start. A lot of hustling. You have to do everything. Our best friend, Catherine, she's the marketing side of the business. She has been part of the team since the beginning. We tend to panic every six months. And she's like, don't worry, this is going to be OK. I get inspiration from a lot of sources, getting many thoughts, ideas, images inside of your head. They mix and then something starts to come out. Carolina will say, you know, I have this vague idea where I want to conceive this collection with these elements. I call it utopian landscape. Something that feels like a journey. An imaginary city floating in an imaginary world. You're ascending, changing your life. Shades of orange and brown and blue. Every day is like, what is something that's going to come from nowhere, from blank, from zero into the reality? I look at the street. I go to the museums, whatever captures the imagination. I really enjoy working with colors. Every detail counts. We're from Cali, the beautiful city with a lot of colors, a lot of salsa, dancing. I am so bad at dancing. Leather work has always been a tradition in Colombia. The culture of craftsmanship is fading away. It has been difficult to, eh, bueno, lo voy a decir en español. La transmisión generacional de esa tradición del cuero ha sido difícil y para nosotros a veces es difícil conseguir personas que saben de ese arte porque ya no, es, no hay joven, gente joven que quiere aprender el arte del cuero. Es muy satisfactorio poder saber que somos unos colombianos que logramos vender un bolso en Nueva York, en una ciudad donde hay tanta moda, y saber que estamos generando empleo en Colombia. We have been growing organically without any outside investment. Sometimes we're tempted to think, okay, should we grow more? Like, should we open a lot of stores? But then we also value time with family. We value slow growth. When you rush stuff, you don't get to produce beautiful things. We wanted Minan Mon to be a means, not an end. And it is a means to have our community uh, flourish. I'm Andres. I'm Carolina. And we're proud to be drivers of tomorrow. <laughs>